Good morning, traders. Welcome to AI Traders Live, live market analysis using artificial intelligence to find high probability trades. In today's AI Traders Live presentation, we'll be focusing on the South African market. We're going to screen the uh, JSE, about 140 shares, looking for the best trade ideas using artificial intelligence uh, engine. Yeah, I'm Richard Miller. He has my contact details. You can look me up on LinkedIn, Twitter or StockTwits. Uh, these are my uh, identification handles. We can look at the South African market from an artificial intelligence trading perspective. There's four AI strategies that we use. Major market reversals, classic swing trades, volatility breakouts, and quick three-day moves. Major market reversals is a uh, trading strategy that uh, the AI has developed. We look, it's more kind of like a position trade. They expect a huge move in the direction of the, the reversal. And classic swing trades is for the swing trader in in, in a few days' time. You swing trade out of it. The holding period is a couple of days to a couple of weeks. And uh, volatility breakouts also a couple of days to a couple of weeks. Quick three-day moves as you're in and you're out on the fourth day. So that's a swing trade. But one of my favorite ones is the major market reversals and the volatility breakouts. And these are position trades that can last from days to weeks to months even. And uh, they are fantastic to trade. So we're going to use these four artificial intelligence generated engines to screen the South African market and the way it works is the AI does 10 to the power of 200 different combinations of technical indicators. It uses genetic algorithms in its analysis, which means is it takes all the available technical indicators and it changes with all available settings. So it will test and retest. It will take all the indicators and test it with all available settings and retest. So it literally looks at everything possible in in the particular market and then it would develop a comeback with the high probability trading strategies when only looking for things at 65 percent plus accuracy normally so you'll see that there's a lot of market relationships or stock relationships that the ai has identified that you might not have found if you were just using normal back testing using technical analysis and that brings us to the four uh, trading strategies that we'll be looking for in the South African market. We'll jump straight into the Metastock platform next. Now the Fulgent AI engine sits on the Metastock platform and I have retrained it a, a while back where I looked, I told the AI, go and look at all the stocks on the JSE, the 140 that I have access to on the Metastock platform, for example, and come back with the high probability trading strategy. So if we look at that, so the AI has already developed that. And we can see major market reversals, there they all are. And you can see on average what the hit rate is. And you can see what on average the profit per trade is. So it's quite good statistics looking at the, uh, the South African market, for example. We then go in the engine and we've selected the AI engine. And I've selected the South African stocks. I'm just scrolling down to the index constituents. There we go. JSE is down. Yeah, there we go. I've got 140 stocks in the database. We're going to look for end of day type uh, trade. You can do intraday as well, but you'll have to retrain the AI for four hour and hourly uh, time frames. But we can look at the daily and we're going to start the exploration. The AI will now go and look at the 140 shares, which ones have the most recent fired artificial intelligence signal. It also shows us the rejects, which ones did not meet the criteria, or the AI has already gotten out of the trade because it's hit the trailing stop loss, for example. Okay, so I'll give it a few minutes. I'll be back as soon as the AI has done its screen. And we're back. Took about 13 minutes and 13 seconds. Two lucky numbers there. Uh, to do the screen. So now I've got the end results there. Out of the 140 shares, there's 49 where the AI is currently in a trade. And I can see there's only longs. If there's a, oh, there's a short there. If there's a one in the long column, it means the AI is in a long position. And if there's a one in the short column, it means there's a short position. The bars tell you all the trades are. So if we search the most recent trades, BHP is recent, Glencore is recent. Uh, the other ones, yeah, you can go down Suntum, five days into a trade. These are trading days. Barlow Worlds, 15 days into a trade. Vodacom, 19 days. Upsa Group, 25 days. So these are all the trades. The AI is in a trade. If we scroll across, we can see which AI is the most recent trade on. So Code 100 is the major market reversals, one of my favorites. And then Classic Swing Trades, 104. 
You can see there 105 is volatility breakout is another one of my favorites. So you have the ID of the AI that we discussed earlier, um, you know, in the presentation. You can see there the codes we discussed those earlier. So we have an idea which AI fired, and we also have a probability of success that the AI, when it did the in the testing period, you, these are high probability trades with average profit per trade there. So very, very good uh, statistics. There's a few rejects, and in most cases, these are normal filter rejections, which means like for Anglo's example, let's go and have a look. Uh, it must have hit the trailing stop loss. It's in a lot of cases, that's the case that it hits the trailing stop loss. Yes, you can see there it hit the trailing stop loss. Now, this is interesting because we had a lovely swing trade here. Look in November, that lasted quite a long time. And then another one, major reversal came, another swing trade, major reversal, another swing trade. So you can see there was a get, get out there hit the trailing stop so the AI recommends getting out so you would have gotten out in the next couple of days or so and if we scroll back you can see here back in March look at this swing trade looks how long that one lost April May June July August and September only before October that it started uh, to, 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 to cash out out of that one and this quick move look there before the big drop so the AI does generate some healthy returns uh, you can adjust your own stop loss five or seven or eight percent stop loss these are volatility adjusted generally the AI is quite conservative in its stop loss policy. The AI signals can also come a day or two early. So in some cases, you'll see a major market reversal. It will still go down even though the signal fired. So Anglo's, just lots of trades out of Anglo's. But the most recent one, it hit the trailing stop. So that's we can see the AI will generate on most instruments. Uh, it will generate a good trade. So these are all uh, some of the ones that it's now out of a trade let's just see if there's any other ones that's interesting mtn will be interesting to see what's happening there we've moved this out so yeah you can see swing trade yeah so not a lot of uh, trades coming out of mtm you can see there huge move there uh, may june fantastic trades there interesting enough you can actually also use the ai on a weekly basis if you're not looking to trade that frequently, you can take the signals on a weekly basis. So on a weekly basis, still in a trade, oddly enough. And you can see also got you out before that big drop there, another swing trade. So plenty of trades to be made on uh, daily and, and uh, weekly charts using the artificial intelligence. But let's go back to the most recent winners and where the AI is in along. We'll start with BHP, for example. It's four days into a trade. I'm just going to move this off the screen here so we can have a bit more screen space. Major reversal. Look how quickly that move occurred. So you literally had one day to get into that trade. Your old highs is now your upside resistance targets there. This range there. That's where your profit targets are up to. So it will be interesting to see if it's going to get there. So it's in along still. And uh, the upside targets are the uh, profit taking targets in this one. Capital and counties. Glencore's in here as well. Let's see where this one is. Major reversal. Look at that beautiful one back here in November. Huge move up. Another swing trade. Huge move up. And now it's moving sideways. Swing trade. Still in a trade. The AI's got a stop loss in here at about 32 hundred so you can see this still long your old highs yeah would be your profit targets these levels here to the upside so that's where you kind of get your resistance zones from is looking at all these old highs so next up is glencore it's four days into a trade let's go and see what this one looks like major reversal there quick move the stop loss has now moved up you can see you had to literally really move quickly look at how the ai put a very wide stop in the beginning and then it adjusts as the price goes uh, higher so glencore should be an easy ride up until about this old high as a resistance zone so that's the upside target there panaf the next one can see a swing trade major reversal look at that one worked out beautifully april may and june nice trade there look at this one back in june july huge move up that major reversal stopped out 
uh, swing trade major reversal there now currently it's recommending a swing trade look at the wide stop loss level there it's at set at uh, let's just see if the AI uh, 273 and the old highs there would be your upside to resistance targets for profit taking so that's the one to look at next up of grow point It takes a few seconds to load. Load, move that. Swing trade, yeah, back in uh, f f uh, January, March, nice move. April, nice move. Swing trade, May, June, nice move. And currently, another swing trade there. Very wide stop loss. You can see it's accommodating for the volatility, but a swing trade is in quick, quick moves back up to 1600 for uh, for a um, position there. So it'll be interesting to see if that one pans out very well. INV prop. There we go. Let's see how this one looks. So swing trade there, huge volatility adjusted stop loss. But you can see there's no quick move there. Swing trade, major market reversal, some fantastic trades on that one as well. Let's have a look at Suntum, five days into a trade. I think they're going to have a few insurance problems, but yeah, you can see. Moving sideways, very choppy actually, but still in a trade. Swing trade recommendation there, stop losses now. Back here at uh, where's that level? Yeah, 23. So you can see the upside resistance targets would be the old highs. Yeah, would be the upside profit targets. So that's uh, that's those are some of the names that the AI is now most recently into a trade. Let's look at Barlow World. It's 15 days into a trade. You can see uh, volatility breakout. So that's moving higher. Old highs here would be the resistance. There was a swing trade in May, so you can see it did, did generate quite a lot of trades. Major reversal back here in August. That trade lasted for quite a couple of months. You can see there are some trades that stay on for quite a while, generating a healthy return. Another one, Vodacom, is 19 days into a trade. Now, this is a particularly choppy one, not a you know, from just looking at the chart, it's not exactly a nice one to trade. If you look at just range bound, bottom in the range, upside resistance, it can't get past that level there. And it keeps buying the bottom end of the range. Yeah, so that's the uh, trade there. Uh, weekly, what does the weekly chart look like? Let's go and see what the weekly chart from the AI perspective looks like. You can see volatility breakout there, still in a long, huge stop loss. A very, very wide stop loss. And you see historically, there's been some great volatility trades looking just at the weekly signals, for example. But here we are with our daily signals on that. So I'll put the list back up here so everybody can have a look at it. And these are the most recent trades. Bars tells you how old the trade is, how many days into a trade it is. It also gives you an idea, you know, which signal fired. Uh, Upside group is in there as well. Uh, 25 days into a trade. Let's go and have a look at Upside group. There we go. Takes a while to load. The more charts you load, the slower the machine. <laughs> There we go, volatility breakout. And if we look back historically, you can see swing trade, yeah, quick move there, volatility breakout, also fantastic. So currently in a long, and the stop loss level is, yeah, 12,560. And the old highs, yeah, would be the upside resistance targets there, uh, profit targets there. So upside groups also in there. Um, so these are the list 49 trades where the AI is in a long. I'll make the list available for downloads. So anybody want to have a look at it? Uh, but these are the most recent ones and uh, as generated by artificial intelligence. And that's how you scan for artificial intelligence trading ideas using AI and identifying those four different type trading strategies that caters for four different type trading styles. If anybody wants more information, you can get hold of me at uh, cloudcharttrader at gmail.com. Uh, email me there or follow me on uh, LinkedIn. Trader at gmail.com. Until next time, happy AI trading. Bye for now.